Hey guys, if you are a Mac user and you are a Sony camera user, then this video is for you because after upgrading to macOS Ventura 13.4 version, there is an issue accessing the XAVC yes file format and I did have the similar issue. I was not able to open any of the XAVC yes file format on my M2 MacBook Pro. Of course, Apple has ruined that particular codec system and uh, with this particular build of 13.4 version, it has completely corrupted that particular file format. So we have to wait for Apple to come up with the latest build and with the latest fixes and we are not sure whether they'll be fixing this particular issue on our next update. However, I'm here to help you out with this particular issue. So I did try to check out all the alternative solutions. I did try to download the drivers from Sony website, tried all the possibilities, but eventually I was not able to handle this XAVCS format. Well, in this particular video, I'm gonna give you an alternative solution about how you can go and use your M2 MacBook Pro or any of the MacBook Pros which you have, which can handle XAVCS file format, and you will be able to use even on your Mac OS Ventura. So let's get into the video and let's get started. Hey guys, hope you guys are doing absolutely fine. Welcome to the channel. Welcome to the new tech video. In this video, we are gonna see the alternative solution for fixing the XAVCS file format. So I did try out a lot of other options, but Eventually, I went ahead and tried to upgrade it to a beta version that is 13.5 Ventura and that literally fixed the issue. Now, I'm going to let you know how you can go and install the beta version and how you can go and access your XAVCS file format. So let's get into the system now. So first, let's go to the system settings and in general tab, we have to go to the software update and in software update, we'll see two options that is automatic updates and checking for updates. So normally you will have automatic updates turned on and beta updates turned off actually. Now what you got to do is you have to click on this information icon which is next to the beta updates. So right next to the beta updates you will see the drop down button and if you click on that you will see three options there. You have to click on macOS Ventura public beta. Now once you click on that and click on done, what it will do is it will go and fetch that public beta version, it will download and it will go and install that particular version. So once it's all restarted and it's all installed, you will be able to go ahead and access your XAVCS file format. I hope this particular video was very useful for you guys and I'm pretty sure this was a showstopper for most of them who is using the Sony cameras and of course it was a showstopper for me as well because I was not able to edit any of my videos since I shoot all my videos on XAVCS and uh, literally had shot a lot of videos recently on XAVCS file format with 120fps and it was literally a painful thing. However, we now know that Apple macOS Ventura 13.5 version will definitely fix this particular issue. But let's wait for that particular update. In the meantime, you can go and install this public beta version and you can go and use your file formats. If you are new to this particular channel, consider subscribing and thank you very much for watching. Talk to you guys on the next one. Cheers.